In today's FX markets, let's take a look at the Canadian dollar as it's moving lower today. Canadian dollar trading down now for a third consecutive session, and today's price action has moved the futures market to its lowest level in four weeks as the Canadian dollar continues to realize some selling pressure here. Currently priced at 0 spot 0.749, which is just off the intraday lows. And we look at some of the driving factors today. A couple of things here. Number one, U.S. data this morning, uh, particularly jobs data, ADP numbers coming in much stronger than anticipated. And that is having an influence to some degree, I think, when you look at the price action in various asset classes. But really, <clears throat> the second driving factor today, I think, is the uh, pressure that we're seeing on crude after initially opening higher. We're seeing crude selling off to basically trade unchanged on the session. And with that dynamic, I think it's having a more significant impact on the Canadian dollar than other currencies today. As you look at the price action, the Canadian dollar is one of the weakest uh, performers today as far as relative strength. We're seeing it down over half a percent here at the zero spot 749 level. And the Australian dollar is another one that's uh, under some pressure. Again, has to do, I think, some regional aspects uh, as far as the, their relation to China. But when you look at most of the major FX markets today, they are higher on the session, even with the stronger than anticipated jobs data and interest rates here in the U.S. moving higher. We're still seeing strength in most of the major FX markets. <clears throat> when you look at the euro, the British pound, the Swiss franc, the Japanese yen, they're all stronger in the session. So an interesting dynamic here today playing out with the Canadian dollar realizing some pretty significant selling pressure and pushing down here to the lowest level in just under a month. With, uh, again, the idea that I think uh, the crude market continues to show signs of struggling here as it gets just over $70 and then we find some selling pressure. And I think that's influencing the Canadian dollar more so than some of the other FX markets. Today, though, uh, Canadian dollar under some pressure, one of the weakest performers along with the Australian dollar in the G10 uh, currency markets with the Canadian dollar trading down to four-week lows.